Welcome back to another episode of Hayden's How To's. In this episode, I'm inside a Tartan 27, currently underneath the fuel tank, and we're going to be repacking this stuffing box. Step one is to loosen the packing gland. You've got two nuts here. One's the actual stuffing box. The other is the locking nut that holds it in place. They're tightened against each other so they don't vibrate loose. Now that they're loose, go ahead and back the big nut until it's completely off. That's how you get it apart. Now, obviously, you want to be on land for this because you'd have water pouring in right now. Now that you've got it apart, you want to dig out all the old packing out of here. And I'm just going to clean up these threads with this wire brush a little bit. One old ring right here. It's pretty worn out too. There's another one. Looks like I still got one more to go. There it is. So all of them are pretty old and nasty looking. Oh no, it actually looks like there's one more in there still. Really important that you make sure you get all of them out. Alright. That, that should be it right there. So now what I like to do is I like to come back over here. Open up our new box of packing. Make sure you get it the right size. Wrap it around. And then you're gonna take a razor blade. Cut it. I like to cut just a little bit of this end here so it makes a nice flat surface. Just like that. You want to make sure when you wrap it around, you're going to have this end here. You want to make sure that as you're putting them in, the gap alternates from side to side. So this one will go in this way. The next one will spin it 180 degrees and put it in that way. And then the third one will go back in like the first one. So it flip flops. And that'll help prevent leaks that make it past this gap from coming through all the way. So usually, I'll just, if it's a 31 like this, I'll just scratch a mark into it so I know where the first one is. On the newer ones, I'll just mark it with a Sharpie. And then, you just want to use your screwdriver to gently push it in. Make sure you push it down evenly all the way. I 
Time to cut another ring. And if you're wondering what size packing to use, typically with a one inch shaft, you want a quarter inch packing. And that's usually, a one inch shaft is usually standard on most 20 to 30 foot boots. Since the first one, the gap is right here, we're gonna turn this one Instead of putting it in like this, we're going to go like this, so the gap is at the bottom. Alright, and here's our last one. And then this one here is going to be the same as the first, insert it with the gap on the top. in go ahead and bring it back down tighten it back up now <clears throat> until the boat goes back in the water I typically only leave this hand tight and I'll just back this nut up so it doesn't come loose and I'll do the final adjustment when the boat's actually in the water. And that's it. Now we just clean up our workspace, get all the old packing material and new packing material out of the bilge. And I really hope this video helped you guys out. And stay tuned for the next one.